find my trail without getting into the thorn bushes. What in the world? Uh, you see it? Uh-huh. What is it? <laughs> That's my question. I don't know. <laughs> it's first, moving. Maybe it's a critter. <laughs> right. In between those... What is that? I don't know. I can make you go first. <laughs> You've got a bigger foot than I... What the heck, guys? to go check and see if we can find that ball. Yeah. A little chilly out here tonight. I can see my breath. It's cool. I hear that big 400 pound owl in the background <laughs> over there. Hoot, hoot, hoot. Something to the right of me carrying on. Well, we left the IR lights at the house and gonna just go with a regular camera light on here tonight. that anything will get up close enough to this bright light, but maybe we'll get lucky. Yeah, they're kind of funny about the white light. Although I was kind of feeling something pacing behind us, so. Get so used to Fumbling around out here in the dark with just the IR light and the little green cap light to go by, it looks totally different when you can actually see the tree. Yeah. And they are carrying on back there, aren't they? Sure sounds like it. I hear the owl, then I hear a short chirp, kind chirp, a, bark, yeah. kind of a... Whatever was carrying on to the right of me stop now. I 
There. There. Right there. The 400 pound owl sounded off and then heard the artificial owl behind it. The woo. The woo. <laughs> Come on up, guys. Oh, somebody's just touched my head. Oh, who's with us? Is that you, buddy? I think it's your buddy. Got me good. <laughs> Not in the, it didn't hurt, but it was pressure, like somebody just put their hand on my head for a second. Okay. You can walk behind. I know you guys don't like the bright light. It's okay. We should have brought the other lights. Next time, I promise. <laughs> I felt like I heard well all right then. There you go. There's one. Come on, guys. Come on, babies. I hear that big, heavy hand slap like a thump against mm -hmm. the tree. Just us. Come on. Oh. <laughs> This other light on, see if. Yeah. Hear that? Oh. Those are the little bitty ones. It's quite that a one started problem. squealing. And they're all right back in the same area we're it, here in the out. It's this light. Again, I apologize for both of us. I'm sorry. You know what it is? Is there? used to us having the infrared and so when they see that infrared they know immediately I mean the ones that are close by know immediately that it's us anyway but why don't you tell them Junior tell them everybody's okay Different right here. Uh -huh. All of those snapped right about at the seven, eight foot mark. Yeah, I'm going to step up there. One of the shorter ones right underneath it. But Just in case they can't see. There's one here. Short one. That one. You see any more? I think the other ones are, well, there's there. I don't know. Here's. We have come down around just below the first gifting tree. Between the two gifting trees are normal ones. Just to kind of be on a familiar trail because it is so easy to get kind of off course and turned around yeah. back there around the mound area. So I thought we would. I'm looking at this take the normal trail back and then cut over Skunk Island that way. Look here. They're all about the same. off and 
stuck in the ground. <laughs> It'd be about the right height for Chuck, but... Uh, well, let's walk up this way just a little bit. And yeah. It's a little narrower to get across the... I was looking at this in front of you first. I saw eyes back there. I see them. Well, come oh, on, guys. Stick your head out here. It's all right. Where are you at? Here's the X. Right across the water. They've been busy right here. This is what had caught my attention. And then I saw that broken. Boots will travel. There's another eyeball back there. <laughs> well, come on. I just heard Joe Jr. <laughs> this is getting complicated. That arch right there. Uh, saying the boys, which I think interprets well. There's several boys. We have Sabaz. We have Davi. Mitch. Sobe. Somebody sitting right over here. Come on, guys. I know you don't like it. <laughs> you know what I really hate? Hmm. When I have a song stuck in my head, I just can't get it to quit. To quit? I smack the back of the jukebox to get the record to skip, change the tune or something. Can yeah. <laughs> I'm just playing. I go out walking yeah. after midnight out in the starlight just hoping you may be somewhere walking after midnight searching for me. That would be a great. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear him? Mm hmm. <laughs> you like it? Oh, man. That's funny. Somebody's sitting right here. Oh, come on. Oh. oh, new brake thrown down there. Yes, That's it's been new. broken. It's not. It's not a root wad. Uh, they're chatting it up back there, aren't they? 
Mm-hmm. I just heard one go, eh. <sighs> Heard a few grunts coming in. But I'm almost sure that was Junior saying hello because it's his usual fashion. When they greet, it's more of a... Uh, my voice isn't low enough or loud enough, but it's more of a guttural... Ooh, you know, similar to a grunt, but it's a little different. It's more of a wolf, like a, how you do it? I can't get my voice down that low. Kind of a, Entering elemental territory, so be aware. <laughs> I'm just looking for eyes shine. There's another squeak back uh -huh. there. Come on, guys. <laughs> uh, come on, guys. Just talk to me here. <laughs> mm, excuse me. Oh, I can't be. 50 or 60 yards straight up out from here but before we cross the water it was right behind it it's circling Well, this is probably going to be about the most shallow place to cut across to... you want it here or do you want it up there? Well, I guess we'll go up this direction. Look, look, look. Oh man, huge print. Oh! Fall down. Right? Heel comes up. Here's a toad. Oh man, it's good and square. I don't know how many inches that is, but from here to here, uh, 14. I don't know. It's more than that. What the heck are y'all doing back there? I think the toes are on my end of it here. Yes. What I can see is a big toe and then comes right. down like so. There's a little indent there that's kind of hard to see, but I think that's a pinky toe. And it's just, that's a female foot. Oh, it jumped that water in one stride because I don't see any print I'm right looking. in there anywhere. I'm looking. And they are tearing it up back here. Uh, find my trail without getting into the 
thorn bushes. What in the world? Uh, you see it? Uh-huh. What is it? <laughs> That's my question. I oh, don't know. Oh. <laughs> it's first, moving. Maybe it's a crater. <laughs> All right. In between those... What is that? I don't know. I can make you go first. <laughs> You've got a bigger foot than a... What the heck, guys? Do you hear them squealing, <laughs> squabbling back there? That's the ball. No. Are you sure? That, yeah, it's the light reflecting off of it. Oh my gosh. Well. Hear him talking? Uh -huh. Somebody's on my right. Come on. Times like this, I'd rather they were just walking. What in the world? I don't know. What is the blue um, on the right? It's a jelly bean bag. <laughs> and a rock. And it uh, well, I'm, what? Just split. I'm glad we did not have to go all the way back to the mound for it. <laughs> Don't touch it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, have you got... I'm going to turn these lights off. You got the UV light? Yeah, somewhere here. Go for it. Some Turn my cap light off. Um, I think. <coughs> well. I'm trying not to. There's some little All right, bit. so those of you that don't know what we're looking at here, we had brought some chemical out and sprayed the ball down when we left it. Don't touch it. I'm trying to see. There's something here. And anyway, when it comes into contact with proteins like off of your hand or if they've been in the peanut butter jar and they've got the proteins from the peanuts and the oil, It'll make it glow when the UV light hits it. I'm going to walk around. I want to see the other side, too. Here. Oh. While we're standing here, shine it on that bag. And the rock? <laughs> Apparently. How'd they manage to handle that? Huh. It's not a distinct pattern but I even see something on the tree there like they had it on their hands and trying touch, to wipe it off. touch the tree <laughs> no I think if they were trying to wipe something and be a bigger let me see the UV light for a second here Taking that rock maybe and banging it against the tree oh. or something that maybe that thumping. Maybe. Here. And scrap off of the bag. So I sprayed the ball and the jelly bean bag down with that stuff. Yeah, I'm not sure where about the rock. I was gonna walk around this bag. Well, so. very carefully roll that ball this direction. Oh, I see smears and half Spots. a handprints and splotches all over it. That looks and little. There's fingers right there. That looks little. 
maybe the babies. Try not to touch anything. That's a little, I don't know. Well, roll it back where they had it. We're not going to take the ball away from them. That was a gift that we gave to them. Yeah, I just wanted to see what we could discover on it, but definitely take that bag because we'll look at it a little bit closer. Now that's all I can figure. Look at that. That thing's lit up like it's a Christmas tree. Man, oh man. Hello. Oh, I hope that comes through. Okay. Wow. Oh, I hope you all can hear this. I have never. You know what? I feel. Turn it over. It's one of the little ones. It's practicing. It is. It's practicing the sounds. Oh, it's running. Behind you. It's running behind you. Don't shine the light oh, over there, Ken. Oh. See the eyes? It's okay, babies. In dead silence. As soon as I put, put the, the light UV on. light that direction, <laughs> they quit. It's okay, babies. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> well, come on, do it again. Way over there. All right, so you got, you got the bag. I'm going to turn the UV light off for a minute. Yeah. I'm going to stand here. and I know you guys can't see anything. Okay, there's but two hopefully voices. Hopefully, you can hear it. There's two voices. Oh, we just had the craziest fog come up right in front of us. There's the, the eyes again. Is that you, Quinn? Duppy? <laughs> They're just practicing sound. I think. All right, I'm going to turn the light on so the people can we see. Have a, like we're standing in this fog right here. I don't know where this All just right. came from. Adjust your eyes. Here it comes. They're not going to like this. Yeah, they just moved. Mm -hmm. And just that flick of a switch Second. went 60, 80 yards to our right. But if you turn the light away, they might. Right now, they're... That's crazy. Thank you, babies. See? I told you to turn the light away. Well, I did. <laughs> no, but I mean, they started again. Here, take this UV light. I can have my hands that's free. Not this, that's not the same sound. No, that's... They Got might have different tones for different moments. They might have an older one with them. Well, I am thrilled with that <laughs> right that there. That was fun. Is that you, Arpina? Can we approach? Not with that light. <laughs> I can hear her thinking too loud. In she, my eye, in my yeah, eye. Yeah, she does not like that. Hide your eyes. She's a little bit, um, our peanut is a little bit critical. <laughs> not in a hateful way, but she's very much the Exactly what were you thinking <laughs> kind of person? Yeah, you know, another three or four weeks, and this is going to be such a mess. Wooly booger we back in here with through. all the green that will be coming on. 
this is definitely their terrain. Well, we're on the very tip of Skunk Island, and they've carried the ball all the way from the mound area to over here. Which is fair. Watching for the gifting trees. Mm -hmm. uh, that Hold that jelly bean bag out, because see, it's only in the UV light, because otherwise you can't see it. A phenolphthalein. Mm -hmm. This fascinates me. Grab the corner and just rip. It's just square. Their nails are really sharp, though. They're just like a knife. Wow, this is too cool. Now they're just being still. Period. Well, they're going to have to put their... Yeah, hide your eyes, hide your eyes. Put your their eyes. goody bucket together and bring it out here for them. We're coming your way, so. See where we find the put ball your heads down. the next time. If you need to, put your heads down. Well, that makes sense then, that footprint you found. I think it might be. Might be our peanut with them tonight over there but on this other side I feel like that was mama squeak <laughs> yeah uh, it's gonna be way too low for the microphones to pick yeah. it up I'm afraid all right so where was that print we um, I think right it up was up here on the right side up here I think try to you know, it all starts looking alike, especially in the dark, right there in front of you. I can see it from here. Wow. Yeah, I see it from the hill angle of it. And that's mom. That's a big print. Yeah. I would say, is that 14? No, Rachel, Six. get your tape measure out. That's every bit of... 18 to 19 well, inches long. Yeah, because here's the toes. Yeah, that's big. Bigger than a bread box. Well, they say when you find a print and you measure it right, to so divide there it. That one, there's got to be a touchdown. Well, let's find a touchdown, but you divide it by two and add one, and hypothetically, that's supposed to be the height. If that were 18 inches, we're talking about 10 feet. Either Tall. that or just genetically has really huge feet, which... Well, that's possible. You know, that's why they call them Bigfoot. Yeah. Or Big Feet, or... I felt like our penis said, leave my feet out of this. <laughs> Footius Maximus. Footius Maximus, that'll work. They're all back over there now. Yeah. Just as fast as that, all the way around. Right, so there's the hollow tree, the big gifting tree. The second one, uh-huh. Footprint. Foot there. Tip I'm of looking. Skunk Island. The ball was right up over the top of it, up on the tip of that. They I'm were still all feeling right like there here. should be another foot, but Ten I can't. Ten minutes ago now, they're, oh man. Way over there, see? They're practicing. I, mean, I, I really hate to say it, but it almost sounds like a chimp, the young ones, making that hop, well, they're, hop, hop they're, I hear a trill in their voice, like they're practicing the um, effects, you know, of how to get the sound. I don't want to get right up on them and make no. them. We already got the light right up on them. They hate the regular white light. All right, guys. We're going to hike on out of here and leave them to it. Figure, that was a treat. Figure out where they hide the ball the next time we come down with the treat bucket. It's really awesome. I wasn't expecting that. I thought we were going to have all. to They hike. were, what were they, 50, 60 yards in front of us, if that? Well, I was talking about the ball. I figured we were going to have to hike another. Uh, I was talking about <laughs> the racket. 
Oh, that's just too cool. But that's how quick they move, and virtually it's almost silent. I mean, the movement. I ain't catch them at times where they're 25, 30 feet away in the dark and literally snap your fingers or blink your eye and they're 60 yards, 75 yards, yeah. one side or the other of that. Well, the one video, they moved so fast we almost didn't see them. The, what was it, two of them came mm -hmm. barreling through there and they were going so fast that it only looked like one and I slowed it down to the slowest setting I could were, possibly find and it was still so fast. And if I'm not mistaken, it looked like they were running parallel to each other. It was just fascinating. Who's stepping? I just heard somebody behind me. Okay, come on. Just me your buddy. Well, they've doubled that up. Uh-huh. Huh. Took's been quiet tonight. I mean, unless he was one of them practicing, I thought it might have been just the babies, but... That's what it sounded like to me, the... Little ones? The little ones. But they're loud already, aren't they? Oh, man. Oh. Barrel chest, they got some lungs on them. Quinn's not so little. He's already... Um, mama. Can you tell me? She said you would say, you would say four feet. So, he's not tiny for his age. Four foot tall would be about the center of my rib cage. I feel like Duffy's smaller though. Maybe three and a half, like proportionately smaller. And to me, you know, stuff like that. I just caught another eyeball up there. Who's that's up gotta there? be that's gotta be Junior, that's his area up in there. Are you up there, buddy? I don't feel him behind us, so it could be that he's up. He was right behind us earlier and I got zinged. When they get right in your space, you can't, you can't mistake it. <laughs> he's correcting me because I said earlier that it felt like a whole hand on my head and he's correcting me and oh, he's easy. saying three fingers. <laughs> Easiest way to give uh, a description, put your tongue on a nine volt battery and hold it there for a second. That is probably close. It's no, it's not as uncomfortable as that. <laughs> My brothers, a bunch of rotten brothers. And they used to make me, get me into all kinds of stuff like that. But no, I had said a whole hand and he corrected me and said that was only three fingers. <laughs> Well, guys, I think we're going to go ahead and wrap this up here. Yeah. Appreciate you tagging along. I hope you enjoyed hearing what we heard out there tonight and seeing the little bit we found. It was a real treat for them to do that kind of a display, right? I mean, right there is trust. That's beautiful. Where are you at? I feel like... I feel like Junior may show off. 
I'm kind of watching these I, trees up here. That's why I'm kind of lingering here. To, <laughs> he likes to I always say we're getting ready to go and then poof, something happens. So Let's give it a few more feet, just in case. Come on, little man, where you at? Little oh. big man, excuse me. Well, guys, we're going to go ahead and wrap this up, and we'll see you next time down the trail. Appreciate you tagging along, and hope you have a great night. Thank Thanks. you.